Today we are going to draw a tree for the sentence. The professor will give her students Chomsky's most recent article on syntax when she can. The first step will be to identify the main verb and its arguments. The main verb in the sentence is the verb give. The professor is the subject. Her students is the indirect object. Chomsky's most recent article on syntax is the direct object and when she can, is an adjunct. Our second step is going to be to identify constituents by applying constituency tests. So for example, the subject, the professor, can be replaced by the pronoun she. Her students can be replaced by the pronoun them. Chomsky's most recent article on syntax can be replaced by the pronoun it. And the adjunct, when she can, can be replaced by an adverb like tomorrow. The next question is where, exactly, the adjunct attaches. Is it to VP or to TP? We know that it is part of the VP because we can replace the entire VP by do so too, as in, and the TA will do so too. This suggests that the adjunct is still part of VP, including the other two objects. The third step is to identify the structure of the major constituents. We can do this by doing a rough tree structure using triangles. So for example, we can identify our subject constituent, indirect object constituent, direct object constituent, and adjunct. Then we can start to build up the VP by having V and its two objects. Then we can add the adjunct to VP. And then finally, we can add the TP layer, which is going to include the subject, T, and the VP. Step four, we are now ready to draw the tree. So first of all, we're going to draw the TP shell as follows, including full X bar structure. The subject, the professor, is going to be a DP with an NP complement. Will will occupy T. The VP, as you remember, has an adjunct, which we will draw later, but leave a space for. The V bar will have three branches, the verb give, the indirect object, and the direct object. The indirect object, her students, is relatively straightforward. In the case, it's just of a D and an NP complement. The second object is a little more complex. We have in spec of DP the proper name Chomsky which is itself a DP. Then we have in D, the apostrophe S. D has itself a complement NP, which will consist of an AP adjunct, most recent, where most is itself an adjunct onto recent. Then we have our NP, which includes the noun article, which has a PP complement, which includes on and then a DP complement syntax. Syntax, we do need to write out the full structure because it has a null determiner. Finally, we can start to draw out the tree structure for our adjunct when she can. The adjunct will consist of a CP with a DP, the WH word when, as its specifier. Then we have our CP with a null C. C will take TP as its complement. The subject, she, occupies specifier position of TP. The modal, can, occupies T. It takes a complement, BP, but this BP is null because it has been elided. And that is a tree.